Hello and welcome to the Northwest Indiana Oilmen Post Game Show. My name is Brandon Pavlina. The final score here tonight from Oil City Stadium. The Northwest Indiana Oilmen 13 and the Lexington Snipes 2. So the Oilmen able to come out victorious in both games. The first game was scored 12 to 2 in favor of the Oilmen. The second game again 13 to 2. The Oilmen tally a total of 25 runs over the course of two games and the Snipes only able to muster four for themselves. So the Oilmen offense here today came out ready to play early and they wanted home field advantage in that first round. And lo and behold, they've gotten it. It's going to be exciting. Again, it's just a really intense two games here today as again, the Oilmen needed to win both games in order to secure the second spot in the Midwest Collegiate League standings, and they were able to do so beating up on the Lexington Snipes in the first game, 12-2, to and then in the second game, 13-2. to Again, the Oilman offense just absolutely in full force here today. They were on a mission to get home field advantage, and they have done that successfully. The Lexington Snipes will be their opponent in the first round of the playoffs. So this is a team that the Oilmen will be very familiar with over the course of the next few days, including the doubleheader here today. And it was a little chippy early as there was an instance where a call was being disputed by Billy Dubois, the Snipes manager, and Brad Wood and him exchanged words on his way out to meeting the umpire. And that pretty much put a spark into this Oilman team as they came back in that first game after trailing early by two runs. They got, a little, they got a little fired up, and again, they were able to tally 12 runs by the time it was all said and done in that first game and win in a sh shortened game due to, again, time constraints and wanting to save pitching here late in the year. So the Oilmen 12-2 in the first game, 13-2 here tonight in the nightcap. Elvis night here at the stadium. We had Michael St. Angel, an Elvis impersonator at the ballpark. He did a tremendous job. The crowd was energized all night long, and it was just a packed house here tonight. Just really great stuff going on all day long for the Northwest Indiana Oilmen. And the best part of it all, the fact that the Northwest Indiana Oilmen now have home field advantage in the first round of the playoffs. So they will not have to travel all the way to Lexington to take on the Snipes. They'll be at home again tomorrow night at 7:10 for the first game of the Midwest Collegiate League playoffs. It's been a long season, and at times it didn't look as if the Oilmen were gonna really be able to figure it out and you know get themselves on the right track. But here late in the season, over the course of this last homestand, the Oilmen went undefeated, winning five consecutive games and that alone is impressive in itself and it's even more impressive considering they had to do so in order to have a chance to get the second seed and they were able to be absolutely flawless in virtually all of those games and now they have home field advantage that was the tall task that they had in front of them after not playing some great baseball they came home here to oil city stadium and were absolutely on a tear and are riding a lot of momentum into the postseason now. So this is a team and a force to reckon with, the Northwest Indiana Oilmen, as they will be taking on the Lexington Snipes in the first round. And the Snipes a talented bunch, but the Oilmen getting the better of them here today. 12-2 to in the first game in favor of the Oilmen, and 13-2 to the final score in the nightcap. As the Oilmen take two games and take second place in the Midwest Collegiate League, and we'll have home field advantage in the first round of the playoffs. Again, it's been a long season, but the playoffs are finally here, and it's going to be an exciting week of baseball. If you haven't had a chance to come out to a game, this may be your last chance this year, as again, it is win or go home time now for the Northwest Indiana Oilmen. We'll be here tomorrow night at 7.10 is the time that the first pitch is slated for for the first game of the playoffs. It's going to be an electric atmosphere. People are going to be hyped up. It's going to be exciting stuff as, again, the Oilmen put on a show here tonight. 
and their bats are looking good, and their starting pitching has been solid all year. Enrique Zamora will be getting the ball tomorrow for the Oilmen, and he is, I'm sure, going to have this place rocking and rolling all night long, especially with his whole family being in attendance, as they always are for when he pitches at Oil City Stadium. So it's going to be an exciting night of baseball tomorrow night here at Oil City Stadium. So, if, again, if you haven't had a chance to come out, Come on out and catch the game. Game scheduled for 7-10. It's the first game of the playoffs. The Oilmen are playing great baseball, and it's just all coming together here late for the Oilmen. And they, again, they're a legitimate contender for the Midwest Collegiate League Championship. There's no reason why this team can't go on a roll here and win the next few games and get themselves a trophy. So it's going to be exciting to see how this team does now with the pressure of winning or going home being on the line. But if, any, if there's any indication of how they're going to play with what we were shown here today, the Oilmen are ready to go, man. These guys are, have been waiting all season long for the postseason, and it's finally here. And again, it's time to you know, turn on the afterburners and really take off if you're the Northwest Indiana Oilmen. So... It's going to be an exciting week of baseball, as I've already said several times. But again, if you haven't had a chance, come on out. The team can use your, use your support. As again, they're going to need to really play some good baseball in order to win the postseason championship. But hopefully they will be able to do just that. And it all starts tomorrow night at 7-10 here at Oil City Stadium, the first game of the postseason. Big hit here tonight, Fred Smart with a three-run home run. I don't know if Brandon gave him Hoosier bat honors, but he's my nod. As again, he had an absolute moonshot out there. The winning pitcher here tonight, Brian Justice, he was strong in the nightcap. Just a complete game for the Northwest Indiana Oilmen. Really good stuff. Great to see this team again playing the type of baseball they're going to need to in the postseason. Again, they just really brought it here today. They were on a mission to get home field advantage, and they've successfully done that. So they will be able to play here at Oil City Stadium twice if needed in the first round of the playoffs. All right, we're going to let you go. It's getting late here from Oil City Stadium.